I'm Dr. Ali Reza Makarem, a urology resident from Shiraz University of Medical Science, Iran. Our study is about giant urethral stone in a 32-year-old man. Urethral stones are a common complaint in primary care centers. Renal colic and hematuria are the classic symptoms. The spontaneous passage of urethral stones is associated with both location and size of the stones. The factors uh, which can increase stone diameters are stone impaction, aggregation of crystals, and distal urethral obstruction. If stones grow to sufficient size, 3 mm can block the ureter, which is the main cause of clinical symptoms. The term giant urethric calculus has been used for urethric stones which exceed 5 cm in length, circumference, or weighing more than 50 grams. In this study, we report the case of large bilateral distal urethral stone with uh, a sacroiliac stone in left kidney. Our case uh, was a 32-year-old man uh, with complaint of bilateral flank pain since six months ago that he used narcotics to reduce his pain. Uh, KUB X-ray findings illustrated a huge left distal urethral calculus uh, with 14 cm length and 106 gram weight, a large right urethral calculus with 3 cm longitudinal diameter, and also an opaque stacked stone in left kidney. IVP showed his overall uh, renal function was normal and acceptable excretion was observed on left side. We employed the combination of open endoscopic technique for treatment of this special case of a stone. He underwent right side transulateral lithotripsy and left open urethral lithotomy through the Gibson incision to remove giant urethric calculus. After that, retrograde internal surgery was performed for, re for reducing bulk of stones, applying urethral essence to ensure the patency of a ureter and facilitating percutaneous nephrolithotomy for the next surgery. Two weeks after the first surgery in the second session, PCNL was conducted to remove the remaining kidney stones. The patient was discharged a few days later. Only 13 case reports of urethral calculi measuring uh, 12 cm or more have been previously published. Therefore, giant urethric stones are so rare. Another rarity of its incidence was due to uh, the normal renal function of patients, whereas in most cases, the kidney above the stone is functionless. There are various techniques in the management of urethral stones. ESWL and PCNL are two most commonly performed treatments, since they are minimally invasive surgical methods that significantly decrease the morbidity of a stone removal. So in conclusion, we need to choose the best and least complicated surgery based on the type, location, and size of the stones. In this picture, you can see a sacred stone in left kidney, a large urethral stone in left side, and a large urethral stone in right side. Thank you. Bye.